It's right now a dangerous trend prompting officials to take action. We're learning new technology now in the works to stop wrong way crashes and officials are now focusing on the Charlotte area. We have learned that crews are testing an all new wrong way vehicle detection system along the Monroe Spre Expressway. And that's where NBC Charlotte's Ruby Durham joins us this morning. So Ruby, last year Charlotte had four wrong way related fatalities. Carolyn, good morning. That's right. Usually when you're behind the wheel, you're you looking for drivers in your rear view mirror or left to right. You're not looking for them to be coming in your same direction, but unfortunately, State Highway Patrol say they get those calls one to two times per week. Caught on camera, a car slamming into another car while driving in the wrong direction. The gut-wrenching accident, just one of 500 along North Carolina interstates between 2000 and 2017. The majority of the time when we have wrong way fatalities, either alcohol or drug impairment is typically the main reason why people are getting on the interstates going the wrong way. So to create a safer driving experience, the North Carolina Turnpike is testing an enhanced wrong way vehicle detection system. Ultimately, it will turn around wrong way drivers along the Triangle Expressway in Raleigh. That same technology will then be implemented along the Monroe Expressway. So how does it work? Take a look at this video from the North Carolina Turnpike Authority. The driver enters the highway in the wrong direction. Runway cameras then alert the driver through flashing lights and lane striping. Moments later, the driver then turns around to drive back in the correct direction. Um, which is exactly the behavior we wanted to, we wanted to influence for wrong way drivers, um, was to see an actual change on the facility before they get up to highway speed where they can really endanger someone else. Been in Carolyn so far on the Triangle Expressway in Raleigh. Four drivers have been detected going the wrong way, but the new technology has stopped them right in their tracks, something they hope continues when the new pilot program is being tested on the Monroe Expressway. I'm reporting this thought this morning for NBC Charlotte. Ruby Durham, back to you guys in the studio. Ruby, that's really some amazing technology. Thanks so much.